Business owner Kim Patton is probably more aware of Christmas creep than most. And typically with retail, Christmas, it always gets pushed earlier and earlier every year. She says she doesn't like it, primarily because it shows no respect for Remembrance Day and the people it honors. One day I just said, you know what, this is just politically incorrect, let's do something, let's give back to the community, and then that's where it kind of created the poppy dress idea. Every year the store makes a donation to the Canadian Legion and buys hundreds of poppies. This year it used those poppies to create two dresses made of poppies, maple leaves and packing paper. We always try and make it extravagant and every time we do a new creation it just seems like it gets bigger and bigger every time. Padden says the reaction from clients has been completely positive. She says she doesn't have a problem with Christmas but she believes there'll be plenty of time to celebrate it later. Across town in Mount Pearl, Ever After Bridal Boutique is marking Remembrance Day too. This full-length gown includes about 2,000 poppies. My inspiration for the dress came from a picture I saw last year on Facebook, and it was done in a storefront window in Europe, and we wanted to recreate it here in honor of our veterans. To show them that we, we don't forget and that we know that we're free because of them and to pay our respects. Corbett Doss says this dress wasn't really designed to be worn, but she's promising that next year, about 11 months after Christmas, that will change. Mark Quinn, CBC News, St. John's.